There's a play called Seven Methods of Killing Kylie Jenner, and that title alone is pretty bizarre, but we'll explain. Plus, Kylie reportedly doesn't want to marry Travis Scott. Hi guys, it's Lisa B for Hollywood Life, and before we get into all that car Jenner tea, let's talk about Aesop Rocky. We have new developments about his arrest in Sweden. He's been in jail for two weeks, and this morning, a Swedish prosecutor wants to keep him in custody for another week. Now, several members of Congress are demanding Rocky's release, saying he's been held in inhumane conditions. Kim Kardashian is also urging lawmakers to look into his case. TMZ says Kanye was the one who actually encouraged Kim to talk to her White House contacts. She reportedly called Trump's son-in-law, Jared Kushner, and explained Rocky's case, who then took it to the president himself. On to another messy situation, Khloe Kardashian and Tristan Thompson. However, we are hearing exclusively their relationship is not as bad as everyone thinks. We're told they're finally making progress with co-parenting true. Tristan's living in LA and makes time to see their daughter. However, Khloe is very clear about boundaries. Switching gears to Kylie Jenner and Travis Scott. The two have been trolling almost everyone with their relationship status and whether or not they're married. Answer, no. No, they're not. In fact, Us Weekly reports Kylie's hesitant to tie the knot. Sources tell the site apparently Travis is, quote, definitely into it, but for Kylie, marriage, quote, isn't important. Well, that's a little bit of an awkward turtle moment. Awkward turtle. Anyway, this site also reports Kim and some friends are, quote, advocating for them to get married because they like the structure of it. Sticking with Kai, there's a play called Seven Methods of Killing Kylie Jenner. And you're not alone if you're confused with that title and maybe a little scared. But a quick Google search will give you tons of reviews on the British play. According to The Guardian, it's the work of Jasmine Lee Jones and explores issues of race, appropriation, beauty, and more. The play has two characters, Cleo and Kara. Cleo is described as a dark-skinned black woman who tweets about seven ways to kill Kylie. Kara, on the other hand, is said to be a light-skinned black woman. So why does Cleo want to kill Kylie? Well, The Guardian says the reason is because she has appropriated black woman's beauty, wearing it as a costume for profit. Jenner's cosmetic fillers may have brought large lips into fashion, but when Mac Instagrammed a picture of a black model with the lips of the same width, she was called ugly. The review ends saying the play never stops being clever. Cleo and Kara openly debate many issues with hard-hitting messages, and sometimes it feels like their characters stepped outside the drama to comment on the real world. But all right, guys, you know the drill by now. Hit that sub, like, and bell button for all the latest Car Jenner news, and let us know if you would like to see this play in the comments below. And if you want to follow me on social media, you can. I'm Brian LA. Bye.